Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Aditya Bayiputranto. I am the Associate Technical Advisor at Sinex Metro Data Indonesia. And today, we will discuss about how to install efficient IP in virtual machine. And today, I will install efficient IP at VMware machine. Okay, and the first, the prerequisite about this acti activity, the first, uh, the virtual machine must already create it, and the specification about uh, how the how big the phys physical, uh, I mean the virtual disk, and then the RAM, and how many uh, network interfaces, I will explain that later. And the second one is efficient IP firmware must be already obtained. You can download uh, efficient IP firmware at support efficient IP website. Okay, let's get start to the demo section. In here, I already create a uh, one VM, and this is the second VM. And the first VM, uh, this is I why I create uh, this two virtual machine is because I'm gonna make this two virtual machine act, uh, as active standby. So uh, there is high availability about. Uh, this virtual machine and the uh, uh, system specification about this virtual machine is the first the memory is 4 gigabit and one uh, CPU virtual CPU and the hard disk is 50 gigabyte and then in this I will uh, edit about this and, and the ISO image wait okay sorry uh, I must restart this virtual machine and in here uh, there is words uh, welcome to solid server and then uh, just uh, leave it uh, default And we are waiting for the loading of the firmware. Automatic uh, installation. Uh, OK. Press OK. And then fetching image file. And so about efficient IP, the uh, the device name is solid server so uh, we call it solid server or SDS just call SDS uh, 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 wait uh, I must reboot this virtual machine Uh, sorry mm. Okay, this is the installation And based on this menu uh, we select uh, this CD room installation yeah. Uh, select the uh, confirm the installation and then we are waiting for the extracting solid server files and done and then we reboot and must login using root and configure the network press enter to reboot Just auto boot. Okay, and I think the booting is done. Oh, wait, I must. Uh, oh, 
power on this power of this case and remove the CD drive in here okay And I think the installation is quite easy and now we are done about the installation and then uh, this we already done the installation and we just let's start to login with root root account login with root and yeah we already uh, log into the efficient IP solid server console and as you see here in here the version is still 6.0.1.p4 and later we will upgrade it to 7.0 and that's enough for today I hope this is informative for you and I like to thank you for viewing.